So, when you watch my IMP typography and you see my 3D element scene like this, my rewrite the stars and my most popular IMP and of beginning and as you can see my 3D scene it looks realistic and it looks good so so many people DM to my Instagram to talk about how to create this one so in this video I will show you a tutorial about how to create 3D room like this and make it realistic in After Effects so without further ado let's do it For the first step, you need to prepare your composition, prepare your camera and black solid and uh, wait a minute, add element effect. After this, you can open your scene setup like this and you need to create custom ground. You can scale it up and you can wait a minute you can add the texture so at this video I will add just a random texture maybe I would like to add just cobblestone like this and then set the UV make it small like this and then the important thing is the animated grass. so for you guys that doesn't watch the tutorial about how to create 3d animated grass, you need to watch it first because that's important steps that you need to know okay so go to file import 3d sequence and find where you uh, located the 3D animated dress. Press. Make sure you need to click the first file 000. Open it. Okay. And it will be like this. Alright. You need to create new folder. And then duplicate duplicate and duplicate make it like this for this tutorial i would like to make the 3d room is small because to make the duration is faster because if i create the process 3d room like my imv typography uh, the, the duration will be a long maybe the 10 minutes so i would like to make it shorter so all right like this chuck into the folder and duplicate the folder like this all right and then create new folder again not this one all right create new folder drag the grass folder into this folder and duplicate to make it to make your work faster like this all right looks good and create the fold new folder again and name it grass like this and drag the grass folder into the grass folder yeah Alright, like this, and it's oh uh, yeah, very laggy. And then you need to add the 3D of other object. So at my video, as you can see, wait a minute. I always add Tori, Tori, and the tree. So and the next IMP still same, Tori and the tree. So 
I would like to add Tori so import find where you locate the 3d Tori I would like to uh, place the link into the description so you can access it where's my Tori all right Tori source uh, I would like to use random scale it up and place like this all right all right like this looks good oh wait a minute all right like this and then add the three the three object where's my three object where is it where is it three model all right I found it check a lot ah. all right oh so big I need to scale it down maybe this is enough like this too small I would like to make it bigger like this duplicate like this and as you can see it's still looks boring so to make it better you can add rock so for this video I would like just use the mountain but I would like to make it smaller this is this 3d model is quietly big all right so big all right there's no texture I would like to add the texture uh, no. all right where's my texture not this one where's my mountain all right I will just to use this one all right and then I will rotate like this all right it's too big I want to make it smaller all right rotate and then place behind the Tori like this all right looks good but it's still bad how can I make it realistic environment all right so to make it realistic you need to use environment all right where's my environment HDRI where's my HDRI alright I would like to make it sunset like my other typography it's always use sunset scene alright so you can use you can download uh, the environment at my description or you can search at polyheaven or other websites okay and it looks like look like this it's okay we will make it realistic click ok it will load all right we will like to drag it down like this 180 all right i will like find the position like this all right looks good okay to so make it realistic go to element render setting physical environment click show in background all right like this and then go to ambient occlusion enable AO and make the SSAO intensity 
to type so with SSAO it will be make the texture or the 3d model is look darker and realistic okay like this make it full uh -huh. I want to make it down okay but it still look bad go to fog enable fog and make the fog to orange because my scene is sunset like this okay fog start distance you can customize well like what you want but I would like to make it 70% of start distance to like this uh, all right looks good and the last thing is create new adjustment layer at race Sapphire race where are my Sapphire race like this alright looks ugly so we need to masking only at the area that have sun sunlight okay so because the sunlight is here I would like to only add the sunlight at this area okay like this all right it looks bad we will make it better go to mass max feather make it maybe 18 so it will be look smooth and setting the rail length and brightness for the brightness maybe i want to just one or maybe two rail length to 0 0.1 not too much Right. Hold on, I need to make the fox start distance it's closer. Maybe like this. And then you need to add the element CC. Nah, looks better. And I would like to set into one like this make the curve is like this so you can screenshot this sapphire glow setting and the curve setting to make it realistic so let let's compare before and after this is before yeah looks uh, looks good but it's uh you know what i mean and this is after okay looks looks very good so this is my key to create my 3d scene it's realistic use glue and setting the curve so eh, how long is it 13 minutes enough for this tutorial so this is tutorial about how to create 3d room and make it realistic element 3d in after effect so thank you for watching don't forget to subscribe like like and share this video to make it more for you <laughs> i think so thank you for watching see you next video goodbye